Got another question for the Unusual Organic Mechanisms playlist, so we're on to number nine now. Hope you like the video, and if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, why don't you think about doing that? But as always, the link to the questions in the description of the video, if you want to try it first. Okay, so starting with step one, elimination of nitrogen gas to form a carbocation. So I've done my usual thing, colour coding atoms and electrons, just to explain where the electrons are going. So carbon's black, so that's its electron in this bond. Nitrogen's blue, that's its electron in the bond. So we've got to eliminate nitrogen gas. So obviously the N2 has got to break away. So the way that happens is a pair of electrons uh, go from the middle of the bond onto that N plus. And that will break that bond and produce nitrogen gas. Uh, it's lost its charge because effectively that nitrogen has gained that black electron. And there's the carbocation formed and the positive charge on that carbon is because the carbon has lost the black electron. Moving on to step two, so it's nucleophilic attack by water, and there's just a reminder, nucleophile is an electron pair donor. So I've drawn a water molecule, shown both of its lone pairs, and you only need one to show how it's gonna act as a nucleophile. It's gonna donate a pair of electrons to the C+, which generates that organic product there. And then in step three, we need proton loss to form the organic product. So the way that's going to work is we need to take a pair of electrons from one of the OH bonds. I'll go for the bottom one. They're going to move onto that oxygen. And that hydrogen will break off as an H plus ion, and it's going to leave phenol as the product. 